My name is Farrah McKenna and I'm the principal at William Rawl Elementary School in Lindenhurst. I'm going to read to you today one of my favorite books called Nuffle Bunny by Mo Willems. He's also one of my favorite authors. Not so long ago, before she could even speak words, Trixie went on an errand with her daddy. Trixie and her daddy went down the block, through the park, past the school, and into the laundromat. Trixie helped her daddy put the laundry into the machine. She even got to put the money in the machine. Then they left. But a block or so later, Trixie realized something. Oh, she doesn't look happy. Trixie turned to her daddy and said, a gaggle, flaggle, clabble, clabble. That's right, replied her daddy. We're going home. I don't know, is that what Trixie meant? Aggle, flaggle, clabble, said Trixie again. Blaggle, plabble, wumbly, flabble, flappy, snurp. Now, please don't get fussy, said her daddy. Well, she had no choice. Trixie bawled. Where? She went boneless. Oh, and a lot of us, a lot of us mommies and daddies know what that is about. She did everything she could to show on how un, to show how unhappy she was. By the time they got home, her daddy was unhappy too. Mm -mm. As soon as Trixie's mommy opened the door, she asked, where's Nuffle Bunny? <sighs> Is that what Trixie was upset about? The whole family ran down the block and they ran through the park. They zoomed past the school and into the laundromat. Trixie's daddy looked for Nuffle Bunny and looked and looked, but Nuffle Bunny was nowhere to be found. So Trixie's daddy decided to look harder until Nuffle Bunny. And those were Trixie's, those, I'm sorry, the, those were the first words Trixie ever said. The end. Well, thank you for joining me today and listening to me read, and I hope you enjoyed our book.